Hi everyone, it's Rhonda here from Flowers and More by Rhonda. Hope everyone's having a wonderful Valentine's Day. Um, I wanted to share with you all my Gone Artsy goodies that I have received. And oh, they are some goodness. Uh, first I want to show you all this lovely beaded trim. Isn't that cute? And it has little tiny leaves on it. Absolutely adorable. And you can also cut it apart and just use the beaded section or just use your, your beautiful little acrylic leaves. So cool. Next, I want to share some of this beautiful trim here. And the cool thing is, this is dyeable. And if you didn't get a chance to join uh, Deb, the owner, she has done a video uh, showing you how to use different chemical dyes on laces. So that's absolutely great. Different ways you can do it. And this beautiful has little bows on it. So cute. And then another trim of hers is this beautiful double-sided lace. Isn't that adorable? Great quality. She has so many different styles to choose from. You can't pick just one. And another great thing she has in the shop are these doilies. She has various different sizes. And I have rearranged my camera and I can't figure out which way to go. <laughs> but this is one. It's cotton, also you can dye it. I love doilies. Here's another beautiful trim. This is sort of an antique white. I love how vintagey it looks. Very pretty. Very pretty. And Deb's laces come in half inch increments. And the prices are amazing. Here is another one. This one is two-tone. Right through the center is a white and then your outer edges are a, are a cream or like an antique white. Isn't that beautiful? Very pretty. Very, very pretty. She's got wide laces and narrow laces. Here's a narrow one. Isn't that gorgeous? This is another antique white, and it's cotton. Again, her dye, or her laces are dyeable. And if you didn't get a chance to see that video, it's it's pretty informative. And then here's this beautiful trim. It's kind of ruffling, has real pretty little pearls in the middle. One of our DTs used this as a um, on a sled that she made. It was DT Linda. And it was just so pretty the way she had it draped over the uh, over the edges of the sleigh. It was absolutely adorable. And this also comes, I believe, in a pink. So she has this in another co option, color option. Um, now, if you are into doing um, weddings as well, like I am, she has a beautiful bracelet. For corsages, which is great for proms too, and this is one of my favorite pieces, and uh, it's stretchable. Let me get that flipped over from where it was in the package. There we go. But this is just a really cool little bracelet. You could even cut it apart and use it. Here we go, and it's stre uh, stretchable. And it just fits right over anyone's wrist. And you can, because it's adjustable as well, so it expands that way. So this is one. It has pearls and rhinestones. I hope you can see the rhinestones in it. But this is just absolutely gorgeous. I love it. And it's pretty to wear plain. 
Very pretty. And then another product, like I said, if you're a DIY bride, she sells, or if you make hair bows, she also has these awesome little clips that are great. And the price on these, you're going to set a four, is outstanding. In fact, she's the lowest price that I've found on these. And I think they're great. Great quality. Easy to work with. So if you make a lot of hair bows, things like that, Deb's the place to go. And then, here is this beautiful piece of wide lace. Now, like I said, she has a variety of sizes of laces. And this is beautiful. It's sort of a mauve color or a dusty rose. Isn't that pretty? I should have showed this one last and opened it all the way up. But it's so stunning. Gorgeous. These would even be pretty to use on clothing if you're a seamstress. This would even be a pretty scarf. I absolutely love that. And then this beautiful piece is gold. Isn't that beautiful? Little bows all in it. So cute. Love it. She has some laces that have the black and the gold in them. Again, her prices are amazing. So if you do bridal, Deb is the place to go. And then look at this cute trim. Isn't this adorable? I just think it is darling. I want to take and cut these apart and put them on a tutu in various areas. I think that would be just the cutest thing to do. I don't sew, so if I find a project that's a no-sew, well, that's the project for me. <laughs> Now, I could stitch these on, I'm sure. Isn't they cute? You could even make little hair breadths with them. Just adorable. And then Deb has uh, various feathers in the store. And these are the ostrich feathers. These are like six to eight inches long. And they are beautiful. This isn't the first set that I've had. And if you got to see the altered mask that I did, uh, put them on there. I don't want to take these all the way out because they're a little, a little difficult to get in. So I want to leave them like that. But her feathers are absolutely beautiful. And these come in a couple of different arrays of colors. And she also has goose feathers on the uh, pads. And then she has feather trim as well. And she has an ostrich feather trim that is one of my favorites as well. And then these beautiful little heart appliques. They are just the cutest. They come on a netting and you can just trim around them. She has a couple of different styles of these. And this one is a multicolored one. And I did a project the other day with one of these on it. Fit absolutely perfect on a paper mache box. So cute. Now I'm going to show you some of her bling. And I love the way Deb has got a uh, a new packaging coming out and I'm really excited for her on that so just let me dump these goodies out but her bling comes in these really cute little organza bags great for reusing for her gifts and uh, but you never know which color you're gonna get so that's a nice little surprise in your package but these are fun little resin flowers. I think they are darling. And these come in an array of colors too in the shop. These are sort of a white or cream. And then she has these adorable little buttons. And they have a little flower with a teeny tiny rhinestone in the middle of them. You could even use these if, like, again, if you sew, 
on your article of clothing that you're sewing or you can put them on projects whatever you want to do they're just darling they look like frosted glass that's what they make me think of and then these beautiful little pieces these are metal uh, I think they're gorgeous they have rhinestones in them as well beautiful and then we have these beautiful pieces now if you do jewelry, these would make excellent earrings. So pretty. And then I think these peaches, 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 because they're sort of a peach color is why I said that. <laughs> I think these pieces are just absolutely stunning. They make me think of my mother. Let me get them out. And she has these, I believe, in a couple of different colors as well. Aren't those beautiful? And they have a pretty little filigree right over here on the side. They're just so pretty. Love them. And then these pieces are an oval. They also come in um, a couple of different colors in the shop. And her prices on her bling is outstanding. These would be gorgeous to use in um, even wedding bouquets or on your wedding invitations. But she also sells slides too. Isn't those pretty? I just love them. But I like blingy stuff. So, got another one here to show you. This one is all pearls. And they are just too cute. And a lot of her bling comes in gold tone or silver tone. Another set that would make beautiful earrings or a beautiful brooch. Again, if you do jewelry. Okay. And then the other bag of goodies. Let's see what we have in those. Oh, we have some bows. Oh, aren't these just too cute? Now, these come in a... These look like they're gold tone, yes. And they have little pearls in them and rhinestones. Get those flipped over. Oh, and they're a nice size. These would be beautiful putting on a shoe. At the top of your shoe. Too cute. Again, if you make uh, barrettes or bows, hair bows, these would be very pretty on them too. And then we have another one just like that, but it's a two tone. These come packaged very nicely. And these are two tone again. So pretty. And then these, I think these are absolutely gorgeous. These would be beautiful if you make up uh, paper flowers to put in the center or uh, if you make fabric flowers, these would make beautiful centers. And they also have the backing on them, so you can use them as buttons as well, again, if you sew. Aren't those adorable? They're just too cute. I think they make beautiful centers for flowers. So cute. And now the last thing I want to show you are these beautiful little and again these are metal too and these would be perfect for jewelry embellishing shoes 
and they're a nice size. Look at that, isn't that great? Absolutely adorable. And there they all are. Let me turn these over. Just some of the beautiful embellishments that she sells in the Gone Artsy shop. Again, these come in a uh, couple different colors as well as these, the stones. But she's got so many pretty pieces of bling. And again, she sells her um, um, lace in half yard increments. So if you're not wanting a whole piece, you can get, you know, just, just the half yard to work with. So those are my Gone Artsy goodies. Uh, share your Gone Artsy goodies with us anytime and post them on the Facebook fan page because we'd love to see the goodies that you got. And be sure to uh, visit us on our YouTube channel at Gone Artsy on the YouTube. And let's see, oh, we have something new going on at Gone Artsy. We now have a Gone Artsy challenge group. So each month they're hosted by one of the DTs and this month it's me. And uh, we'd love to have you just create a Valentine. And there is a uh, album to put your project in. And the rolls are in the files of the group and they're pretty easy. And you can earn entries and extra entries. And you can win yourself a $10 gift certificate to the Gone Artsy Shop on Zivit. And get yourself some of these beautiful goodies. But in the meantime, thanks for stopping by and checking out all this awesomeness. Have a happy, happy Valentine's Day. And we'll be checking you all out. And don't forget about our Ustream shows. Because um, we'd love to have you join. Thanks everyone. Until next time. Bye-bye.